20 years from now, I always want to remember um, the look on our kids' faces when they see something new or something grand and see God's creation and, and how it all works together. My favorite part of the trip like was uh, uh like going to the hotel. We fit in two campsites. One, it was super awesome. There was a roaring river right next to us. We didn't need our sleep sound on. And the other was so fun. There were so tall trees and awesome rocks to climb. Look at my hot dog already. Look at my hot dog already. Ah, I got you. Look at my hot dog already. Ah, my hot dog's got this hot dog. You know, 20 years from now, I hope to remember um, how fun it was all being uh, tight knit, the six of us. Like, um, as we adventured, there was, you know, some difficulties, um, some time in the van we didn't plan on, some uh, plans that didn't work out quite as we thought. Um, and yet, everybody stuck together and got along really well, and it was just really nice spending that time together, not distracted by, um, you know, regular life. What has been your favorite thing about the whole trip? Oh, okay. So, it's been hiking. Just a, a little bitty waterfall uh, that was really pretty, and it went out into the went around 
going to the grass on the side of the road, and um, I said, can we pull over and look at it? And my dad said, yes. So we pulled over and looked at it. Then I saw this trail float up the side of the water. I wonder, what would it be up there? And it was a very beautiful sight, but for just a little waterfall. And then, so I went up the trail. And then there was these little waterfalls that all connected into one big waterfall and then went down into that little waterfall. And it was like, and some would go like around the plants and some would go under logs, some would go pile up in little um, piles, puddles of little pebbles and then they'd go down really far and it was, it was the best part. The most awesome part of this trip was probably just stepping out of our daily routine and um, pushing our comfort level a little bit and um, getting out of that um, comfort zone so that we can really test ourselves and um, connect on an intimate level that just isn't isn't possible on the, in the daily day. My favorite memory from the vacation, there's probably a couple of them, uh, the night that Lucas and uh, Charlotte were sick, and uh, you guys were in the, the hotel, and I was uh, with just Jack and Matthew at the uh, Clear Creek Camp, um, just had such an amazing conversation with the boys, um, really like seeing how they're growing up. We talked about God. We talked about girls, we talked about guns, and the boys just talked to me like the whole time. Um, it was really, um, really a neat thing for me. Coolest thing I've seen is the sand awesome thing that I've seen on this trip would probably be the Helen Hunt Falls. The Royal Gorge may have been pretty awesome, but I, would, I wouldn't. I 
stand aside on the very point you're on. The worst part would have to be Charlotte fell in a deep, deep pit. It was really scary. So, this is where I fell. Slid down from that rock. Flipped over, hit my head on the side of that rock, and landed on my head and my back. What has been the worst part of the trip? Um, Charlotte falling over there? Uh, I'm gonna remember camping and staying together. <laughs> the climb to the top of the sand dunes was pretty incredible. Um, the hike to the top of uh, Devil's Head Fire Lookout uh, was pretty incredible, but as it, beautiful and amazing as that is, just kind of the look on um, the kids' face when they, they first saw something, not after they were tired and exhausted and had seen mountains for a week, um, but at first, like climbing up Helen Hunt Falls, the, um, the, the wonder on everybody's face was amazing.